it's that time again. It's King Slayer Hoops, and welcome to another NBA 2K21 tutorial. Today, we're going to be doing sort of a part two to the Nuggets playbook that we've been covering. This playbook is really nasty. Uh, the other day, I showed you guys a bunch of plays that work really well, both online and offline. Make sure you go check that video out first. And then what we're going to do is add two more plays to that today so that you could have a really well-rounded attack with the Nuggets playbook. The ones today are going to be focused a little bit more on the post and post passing. But yeah, guys, before we get into the actual plays, hit that like button to support my channel, which is still a smaller growing channel. And be sure to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss another one of these videos, which will make you a better 2K player. I guarantee it. Like that uh, men's warehouse guy. Remember him? All right. Anyway, let's get into it, man. All right, so the first money play we're gonna be looking at today is called Cut Elbow 5-4. And first of all, just be aware that you're gonna need uh, big men, specifically centers, that can pass to run most of the plays in this Denver playbook. So just keep that in mind. Uh, important roster distinction to keep in mind. All right, so first of all, I'm gonna show you guys the play in real time and then we'll slow it down. Look how simple that is. We'll slow that down for you, but it, it's pretty cut and dry. We're gonna pass the ball into the center here. He's gonna be either in the high post or at the elbow. And then the passer is just gonna do a little back cut and there's nobody there to meet him at the basket. Now, let's go to another option on this play. If that back cut is not open, here's what you can do. So we get it to Jokic again, same play here. You can see that's not open, but ooh, look at that, very sneaky. So we'll slow that down. We get the ball to Jokic again. We get a back cut from Murray. We're not gonna hit Murray on the cut this time. So instead, what he's gonna do is go over to the corner and screen, and then your guy in the corner is gonna cut off of that screen. Look how beautiful that is. I love plays like this. Really catches opponents off guard online. And uh, here's another option. This would be the third option for this cut elbow play. Look at that, flows right into a pick and roll. Boom. So one more time, we get it into Jokic. The passer is gonna do a little back cut. We're not gonna hit him on the back cut. The passer is then gonna set a screen for Millsap. We're not gonna hit Millsap. Then the passer comes up, receives the ball again and it flows directly into a little pick and it's actually sort of a pick and pop there and we knock it down with Jokic. So that's play number one of the two plays I'm gonna be showing you today. Play number two is called Punch Five Quick and this is one of the best post up plays in the game. It has been for a couple years now. And let's show it to you guys. This one is also pretty simple, not too complicated. So the first option, obviously, if we get it into the post, and you feel like you can score, then go for it. We're just gonna drop step on that one. I'll slow it down for you guys again, but it's a simple concept. You don't have to drop step. You can use whatever uh, post moves you wanna use here, but obviously the drop step is one of the most broken moves in 2K. So that's your first option. Now let's get a little, little more complex than that. We get it down to the post and we get a baseline cut from Jamal Murray. So simple, but so good. I'm telling y'all, this Denver playbook is really slept on. I don't hear too many people talking about Denver's playbook, but look at that, slow motion. And I'm gonna show you guys all this stuff working online in just a second, but one more option for this play. The way this one's gonna work is, again, we're gonna get it down to the post, and we're gonna get a back cut one more time from Murray. We're not gonna hit Murray, but we have a three-point option on this one too. Look at that, Gary Harris, but a bing from downtown. So one more time in slow motion, we get it down to Jokic. Murray with the little back cut. The cut is not there, but look at that screen and a three from Gary Harris. So guys, let's jump into the online gameplay, which is the fun part, but I am gonna warn you, I made a lot of people mad with this playbook, so you're gonna see a whole bunch of rage quits. I'm just, I'm warning you now. I'm warning you now, we're not even gonna be able to get a full game. That's how good these plays are. We're gonna be using the plays I showed you today as well as the plays that I showed you guys in part one last week of this Denver uh, Money Plays breakdown. So keep that in mind. Like this play right here was one that I showed you guys last week. And look at this. We're just gonna use the spacing actually because he decides to go into his own and that ain't gonna work, buddy. I'm gonna throw it down on you with Will Barton. 
Hopefully Barton comes back stronger next season. But anyway, we're going against the same Philly opponent again. First quarter here. And he's going into his zone against these plays. That ain't going to work. We got a guy open in the corner. Knock it down for three. And guess what? It is time. Yeah, he quit already. And we're going to be seeing a lot of Rafiki today. We go to our second game. This time our opponent is using the Utah Jazz. So let's see what we can do against the Jazz defense, which is pretty formidable. Going to hit Jamal Murray on this back cut. Beautiful play. The cuts in this playbook are just not even fair. Just utterly ridiculous. We go to fist five out four again. Look at this, cut inside, Troy Daniels, too easy. He's clearly outmatched and... It is time. Oh, we, we got chopped and screwed Rafiki there. But yeah, another opponent out of there. So we go to our third game, trying to get you guys a full game of gameplay for this tutorial, but the, the community they, they just can't handle it. The 2K community cannot handle these plays. They just keep quitting. In this game against the Portland Trailblazers, we knocked down a three off of that play. This five out four again. Let's see if we can hit him with that cut one more time. Uh, we do not get the basket, but we get fouled. And... It is time. You are the weakest link, goodbye. Uh, I heard that show's back actually. The, uh, people probably don't even know what I'm talking about. But anyway, all right, this is the last game I'm going to show you guys. Another one against the Portland Trailblazers. Let's see if we can get a full game. Let's see. Uh, right here, we're going to go quick five out three. One of the plays that I showed you guys in that last video. And look at this. We're going to get not an open three, but that flows directly into a pick and roll. And Nikola Jokic throwing it down. That is not exactly his game. But yeah, we're gonna go to that quick horns flex play. One of my favorite plays in the whole game. Back cut there off of the screen. And Murray throws it down. Don't worry guys, I know you guys aren't seeing the, the plays that I showed you in this video yet, but trust me, they're coming, they're coming. We get another one off of a really nice cut. Uh, here we go, cut elbow 5-4. This is one of the plays that I just showed you guys uh, in this video. And look at that, it's not even fair, and one. But at least we're going to make it through the first quarter without my opponent quitting. That's that's a first for today. That hasn't happened yet. Uh, we go back to that fist five out four play. That cut is actually not there for us. So we go to our next option directly into a pick and roll. Michael Porter Jr. Passes the ball out. Jeremy Grant knocks it down. Grant was actually really good in the playoffs this year. Shout out to Jeremy Grant. Quick five out three now. Comes off that cut. Right there, Jamal Murray to Gary Harris into the pick and roll again. He left the corner open and Will Barton, that is money. But a bing from downtown. All right, now back to cut elbow 5-4. We get it to Jokic. And can we hit him on that cut? Yes, we can. Murray throwing it down again. So we get off to an 11 point lead. It's down to nine now, but we go back to quick one horns flex. Just killing him with cuts. That ugly alley-oop animation. Alley-oops are a little bit too easy this year, if we're being honest. They're a little bit too OP. But maybe they'll patch that, maybe not. We go to our punch five quick play. Backdoor cut. <laughs> it's This guy is just getting annihilated with cuts. It's not even fair. I actually feel a little bit bad. But we get it back inside with that punch five play again. They left the corner open. Will Barton again, but a bing from downtown. We're going to just spam that same punch five quick play back inside. And Jokic has a smaller defender on him. You know what time it is. Nom, 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 nom. Eat him up inside. Pause. I didn't mean that. Uh, back inside to Jokic again. We're just spamming this play. Spamming it. Pass the ball around, a three, <laughs> Barton again. Will Barton knocking down shots. We go to cut elbow 5-4. We're up 13 now. We hit him on the cut one more time, and I told you alley-oops are broken. That's ridiculous. Maybe we're going to get a full game here. Oh. It is time. Yeah, we could not get a full game for you guys, but that just shows you how good this playbook is. 
Again, guys, if you appreciated this one, please hit that like button and that subscribe button. It would help me out a great, great deal. Let me know how all these Nuggets plays work for you. And until next time, happy gaming, y'all.